Hello everyone and welcome to our new video. I'm Jack from One Site Solutions and today I'll be going over SMA and Enterprise SMA. I'll be covering what exactly they are and also the benefits that follow. So I hope you enjoy the video. So you may be asking, what exactly is an SMA? So an SMA is a software maintenance agreement and is purchased on individual licenses. It's active software and N4 controllers and supervisors and your SMA must be active to upgrade your Niagara versions. It's also good to note that an SMA is mandatory at the point of purchase. You're allowed an initial 18 months for installation time and renewals are available beyond those initial 18 months too. So, the benefits of an SMA. There are massive benefits and why you should keep your SMA up to date. And to be honest, there isn't a reason why you should not be at least at the current long-term support build of Niagara, which is 410. Niagara 4 is a mature product now and was released all the way back in 2015. And during this time, there's been many additions, enhancements, many, many bug fixes, drivers, tools, and many components added to each patch of Niagara. This is why I believe it's important to keep your site bang up to date. If your site maybe isn't at 4.13 and is not using all the newest features and tools, I would like to really reiterate that it's important that your site is maintained to at least 4.10, just so you're covered by all the newest security features and the bug fixes prior to that. The reason why this is important, because in each build of Niagara there are external bodies that run the CVSS, and this is the Common Vulnerability Scoring System, which Niagara Development are of course made aware of. These scores consist of cybersecurity risks, network implications, script issues, and anything will score against the system. Once these scores are given to the Tridium development team, they will send out certain patches to cover the vulnerabilities, and will keep up with any further scores given in the future too. I believe 4.10 has around six different patches released over a quite a long period of time, and that's the reason why it's the current long-term supported build of Niagara. So, to go over Enterprise SMA a bit, this is a site that you may have picked up that's been deployed by multiple different SIs at different dates, all possibly of different branding too. To anyone, this site would not be ideal at all, especially of trying to cover the maintenance. It's possible that all these different devices will have different maintenance end dates and different agreements, which would be really hard to look over, especially when a site is at a very large scale. And this is where Enterprise SMA comes into play. This is an ideal version of what your site should really look like, and this is where all of your licenses and agreements are tied into one. So how the Enterprise SMA works is that you choose a renewal period and all licenses are automatically updated. You can choose the start date and choose the maintenance end date too. If you have not read through the description, the Enterprise SMA will align all of your Niagara licenses into one agreement. It will have the same start and end date and be in a single bill of materials, including all the expired SMAs too. This will be so much easier to track and keep an eye of, especially when you're on a very large site. This is going to avoid any misaligned versions, as you can see. As many engineers will know, having a mismatch in Niagara versions normally causes problems. So having this agreement in place will possibly save downtime and also avoid the possibility of any errors. So now that we've spoke about it, how do we actually put it into place? To align your Niagara licenses into a single agreement, including the expired SMAs like we spoke about, you must have a minimum of five licenses. You can choose one, three, or five years, and which is even better is your licenses are automatically updated to. Another thing which is great is that there's a grace period the grace period is SMA coverage that Tridium gives and no charge as part of the enrollment process to the Enterprise SMA. The management tool looks at the SMA expiration date and the proposed new expiry date and calculates the number between those two dates and anything that remains, which is less than a year, is covered by grace. One site solutions will manage all of this for you and all that we would require from you is a list of host studies sent to sales at onesite.solutions, which you can see in the bottom right. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe.